this is Keithius, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda. And last time we were about to go get the Silver Sword, I believe. Or Metal Sword, or... It's not the Magic Sword. I don't actually know what it's called. The White Sword, I think. There we go. And some more money, which is always nice, because I need it. like to at some point here by a big shield, but we'll get to that. And I'm sorry if you're disappointed that I've spent all my time on the overworld so far. That's kind of just the way I roll. Ah, bounce rocks. Bounce rocks. I hate you. you guys, oh, damn it. Sky, run away, run away! Phew, made it. Yeah, yeah, master using what? I got your master. Oh, yeah. For a second there, I thought I didn't have enough hard containers, but I do. Oh, yeah. I know this is kind of sequence breaking in a way, but I don't care. This is the way I like to do it. Right here, because then I'll get stuck in that annoying loop. Oh, come here, fairy. I can use you. Really? Oh, yes. Oh, god damn it. Not it. Okay. There's Fratza, Fratza. I hate that guy. Oh, freaking rocks. Run. Run, Link, run. Oh, yes. Uh, see, I'm getting better here. I will eventually stop sucking, I swear. And round and round we go, where do we stop? When we get 90 rupees. Which I'd really like to happen sooner rather than later. These guys are always good for rupees. They always give me a lot. I like those red levers. And let me just check something. too much time. So... Now that I have the white sword, I can finally kill that guy in the water with one hit. Which is what it takes, because if you don't kill him with one hit, he just immediately hides himself. Oh no, I already got that one. Bummer. And I already got that one. Bummer. I can kill the blue guys in two hits now. But I've managed to get 90 rupees anyway, so... There. Oh! Alright, cool. Lost my concentration for a second. I have to be careful around some of these bushes, because I think there's one right here, where if I burned it down, we get the old pay-me-for-the-door-repair-charge guy. I promise, we're almost there. We're gonna get to the first level, eventually. It's only taken us, what, three, four videos now? And everybody knows about this one. It's the cheap shield shop. Ah. Now I can deflect fireballs. And I think I am finally ready to go to the first dungeon, <laughs> the first level. I'm only, you know, outfitted for, like, level 4 here. I still miss not having my boomerang, though, so... I don't need that fairy right now. And... Yeah. Alright! Level 1! Aw, oh, I can't get through there. I need a key. Now, 
I'm not going to be using a map for these things. I was only using a map on the overworld just to save myself a little bit of wandering around time, which in the end didn't really save that much time, but whatever. Now these uh, dungeons, labyrinths, mazes, castles, whatever, these I am going to be doing entirely from memory, as I said, except for level 9, because I suck at that one. Ah, uh, money, yes. I remember most of these pretty much by heart. Only these skeletons would be quite hard. I know they're called Stalfos, but they're skeletons to me, so whatever. But now that I have the white sword, they're easy. Do 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 do. Always thought that sounded like come and get your key. bomb up here, but I'm saving my bombs, so... Oh yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. Getting some sweet dungeon action. And do 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 do. Get all the bats. You only have one link sword on the screen at once, so once you shoot your sword out once, you can't shoot out another beam until it hits something, or hits a wall, or something. Secret door. Uh, I'm not too fond of this gamepad. It makes precision movement a little bit difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Haha, <laughs> in your face, old man. But everybody does that, so it's alright. I don't know why everyone hates that old man. These little gels. They're easy even if you have a wood sword. And there's our map. Not that I really needed it, but. Sorry if you can hear it creaking in the background. It's... These guys would normally be quite difficult if I didn't. Oh, lucked out there. Normally be quite difficult with just a wooden sword. And who gives poor Link nothing but a wooden sword to start with anyways? It's kind of rough on the poor guy. Oh, yay! Hold it over your head, Link. Like a man. Of course, we can't do anything with it yet, because you have to buy your arrows. And then they cost a rupee each. So that's kind of boring. I wonder if anyone watching this video was not even born when it came out. It's entirely possible at this day and age. It's almost been out for a long time. And that makes me feel very, very old. obsessive compulsive about that. I like to get every room possible. Oh yes. Thank you. Boomerang. My all-purpose castle companion. Oh god, this room. I hate the fucking hands. Unfortunately, I have a sword that can kill them with one hit. And a boomerang so I can pick stuff up without having to Alright, boss time! Yay! Not even any special music. Just shoot him. Yay, that was hard. Actually, that would have been a little bit challenging if you still had just the wood so wooden sword and three hearts, so. And we get our first piece of the Triforce, which is good because we're coming up on ten minutes here, and I think that's gonna do it. So, I'm gonna come out here, say goodbye. And uh, tune in next time for more of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda. This is Keithius signing off. I'll see you next time. Bye.